Hello and welcome back to the Trainers of the World Tournament. I'm your host, Delta TDS, and today for match 82, we've got the Kanto Gym Leader Janine going up against the Battle Legend Blue. We've got a Kanto Regional match today. Janine's got the Mega Beedrill, just like her dad, as Blue's got the Mega Pidgeot. Uh, Blue took round one, I believe, in a 2 0 lead against Caitlyn. She was the first Univate Elite Four to fall, and soon everyone else just started following after, except for Grimsley. But once these trainers are ready, we can see how Janine could possibly stand up against just the Alkazam alone. Janine sending out that Beedrill, Blue with that Pidgeot. Both Megas, just right off the bat. Beedrill, you turning out of there into that tentacle. Going for the Hurricane. Dealing over half to that tentacle. Pidgeot's a good Mega. Got a good special attack. Got good speed. Got a good ability. It just does not have good special normal moves. All it's got is like Hyper Beam and that's it. Hurricane does take out the tentacle. Janine switching back out to that B drill. Uh, Big Dick B back out here once again. Going for that U turn. Getting back out of there. Into that Nitto King. Or Queen. Whoops. God, what is going on? Pidgeot go for Roost. Uh, switching out to the Tyranitar. Thunder Punch dealing about the quarter to Tyranitar. Janine switching out to that Weezing as Tyranitar sets up a Dragon Dance. Crunch is going to deal about two thirds to Weezing as Weezing gets that burn off. Uh, going to be cutting Tyranitar's attack down. Tyranitar going for Crunch, dealing about a quarter. Sludge Bomb going to deal a little under a quarter. And that burn does take out. Tyranitar as it takes out the Weezing. Blue sending out that Gyarados, Venom and Janine sends out that Venomoth. Blue switching out that sleeping Gyarados for the Arcanine. Arcanine gonna be terrifying for this uh, Venomoth and that Beedrill as well. Minimoth going for the Psychic, dealing over half to Arcanine, as Flare Blitz does take out that Venomoth, and Beedrill coming back out here, I think we might see it once again, once more for round 3. Beedrill going for that Fell Stinger, not able to get the boost because it didn't KO. Go for U-Turn to switch out into that Gliscor, Dynamic Punch can deal. Order to Gliscor, get the confusion. That toxic orb, toxics to Gliscor. Blue switching out to that Gyarados, getting that attack drop. Snaps out of confusion. Stone Edge dealing almost half to that Gyarados, as Gliscor nearly heals all the way up thanks to that tox or poison heal. And another Stone Edge with a crit takes out that Gyarados. Uh, Machamp with the Ice Punch does take out that Gliscor. Beedrill back out here once again. We love Big Dig B. This thing has the Fell Stinger and you turned its way to safety. Going for another U turn, switching out to that Nitto Queen. It's not looking too hot for Janine. Pidgeot going for the Roost. Ice Push can deal 35% thanks to Pidgeot losing that flying type. 
Hurricane's gonna deal 71 as Nidal Queen goes for another Ice Punch and takes out that Pidgeot. Now Beat Drill versus an Arcanine, a Machamp, and an Alakazam. Guess we'll just have to see if Janine can make this work. Sending out the Alkazam uh, as Janine sends out that Beedrill. Bell Stinger goes for the gets the KO. Plus three attack. Champ coming out here. See what it can do. Poison jab takes out the Machamp. Off for Felstinger again. Get max attack. Intimidate gonna take out one of those attack boosts, but it's still got two more. Street Speed gonna deal almost two thirds to Beedrill, but Poison Jab takes it out, and Janine bringing it back with that Beedrill takes game number one against Blue. What an insane turn of events. Honestly, I did not expect Janine to win that, but I mean, there's still two, possibly two more games. We'll just have to see how uh, how Blue changes his, his style. We're back on the field, and once these trainers are ready, we can see if Blue can take out the speed drill becomes, before it becomes too much of a threat. Janine starting off with that Venomoth, Blue with the Tyranitar. Venomoth going for that Sleep Powder. Blue switching out to that Pidgeot as Venomoth goes for that Quiver Dance. Dancing up the storm. Psychic gonna deal 50% to Pidgeot as Hurricane does take out the Venomoth. Janine switching out into that Nidoqueen Queen as Blue switches back out to that Tyranitar. Poison Jab gonna deal about 20% to it. Janine switching out to Gliscor. Tyranitar wakes up and starts dragon dancing. Setting up those boosts. Brock Slide gonna miss the Gliscor as it goes for Cold Fox. Getting that accuracy boost so it doesn't miss any more stone edges. Missing another rock slide. Earthquake takes out the Tyranitar. Uh, Earthquake or er, Intimidate does get rid of that attack boost, but not the accuracy boost, which helps that stone edge land. Dealing 75%. Gyarados with the Dragon Dance and Ice Fang will take out the Gliscor. Janine is sending out that Weezing. I don't remember saying much from it. Waterfall gonna deal 60%. Guess the flinch. Rocky Helmet does take out that Gyarados. So, losing at least gets a body on its count. Blue sending out the Alakazam as Janine sends out that Beedrill. Uh, Blue immediately switching out that Alakazam. Beedrill going for that Fell Stinger. It wants that sweet attack boost. I think the only way... would be able to get a or take out that Beedrill is to get two extreme speeds off on that Beedrill. So otherwise Beedrill outspeeds basically everything. I believe yes. Tentacle go for sludge bomb. 
Pidgeot's down to 12%, the Curl is up to 75%. Roost healing it up, the Sludge Bob bringing it down to 20%. Just slowly getting more HP back. Go for the Hurricane, dealing over half to the Tentacle. As a Sludge Bomb does take out that Pidgeot. Extreme Speed, it takes out that Tentacle. Janine is sending out the Nidoqueen Queen here, just this one. Go for the Earthquake, taking out that Machamp. Ooh, sending out the Alkazam. Psychic with the crit takes out that Nidoqueen. Queen. And it's all down to Beedrill and against Arcanine and Alkazam. Felstinger does take out the Alkazam. With now Arcanine versus Beedrill here. We saw Extreme Speed do 60%. Drill Run does take out the Arcanine. And Janine in a 2-0 lead takes blue out of the tournament. Crazy, we see both red and blue fall. Uh, Janine goes on to round three, where she'll be going up against the winner of tomorrow's match, uh, which is between Maylene and Avery. Thank you so much for watching, and until then, take care.